Hi kids, I'm here to show you how to put together your box and your bags to be part of the Light em Up uh, outreach that we're doing this year. So just pay attention, I'm gonna show you what's inside each box and how to make it. Um, so pay attention as we kind of go through everything. Um, what the, one of the things that you're gonna be making is this uh, snowman uh, that's made out of a Hershey bar. Um, so basically all you need to do is just wrap it in this paper, tape it. Um, all the supplies will be in a baggie for you, so everything will be put together um, piece by piece for you. Um, but you want to glue on the earmuffs. Um, I use hot glue. Regular glue is a little bit difficult, um, but either one will work. And then you'll cut the felt to make a uh, scarf and then put the eyes and the nose and the mouth and the buttons on it but you can be really creative and you can do whatever you want to with your snowman but this is just the basics um, of how to put together the, your Hershey bar snowman um, the other thing that we're going to be making is a candle holder um, or a lantern um, and you'll have a jar inside your bag with a whole bunch of tissue paper with it and so basically you're just going to use regular glue regular elmer's glue um add a little bit of water to it so maybe put it on a plate or in a bowl and then just add a little bit of water to kind of thin it out a little bit um, and then you're just going to paint onto your jar and you're going to add your tissue paper to it like this and it sticks really easy I would recommend just doing uh, strips at a time. Um, and you can overlap the paper as well. And then once you get the paper on it, it works best if you can go back over the tissue paper to kind of flatten it out a little bit so that it sticks um, better to the, to the jar. And like I said, you can overlap the tissue paper it makes it kind of gives it a cool effect um, and also inside your uh, jar um, was a candle so once you're all finished you can put the lid on if you want to decorate the lid you can but afterwards you put your uh, candle inside uh, your jar um, and then put the lid on and then that's ready to give as well, put back in your bag and to give to um, your assigned person. Um, another thing that you're gonna be able to make is a prayer box. Um, you can decorate the outside of the box and then inside are sticky notes. Um, the idea is to give this to the, put it inside your bag and give it to the person so that they can write their prayer requests on it and then put it back in the box and give it back to you so that you can pray for them during this holiday season. Um, a couple of other things, um, there is a pen inside your box that you can give to the person um, to write their prayer requests on. Um, it'd be neat if you could decorate your front of your bag. And then also, um, Cooper is making us a Christmas card um, so that you can decorate uh, as well. Um, a couple other ideas would be to put make some cookies and put in the bag, but make it your own. Um, and make it personal and make it fun for you to be able to give to uh, the person that you are assigned to. Uh, the person that you are assigned to will be inside the box. And if you need instructions on how to get to them, um, you can just contact me and I can get, get you that information. Uh, one other thing is we would love for you to take a picture of you delivering the bag um, or a video or pictures of you doing crafts so that we can put that together for our Christmas Eve service. Uh, I hope you have fun, and if you have any questions, please let me know.